Hello, I'm Mayor Tashara Jones. Thank you for tuning in to Two Minutes with Mayor TJ, the Black History Month edition. Today, I wanted to focus on Homer G. Phillips Hospital and the role it played in building a generation of black doctors and nurses, not just here in St. Louis, but across the country. While St. Louis's black population grew in the early 1900s, in the era of segregation, black residents did not have access to the same level of medical care as white residents. Lawyer Homer G. Phillips led the charge to construct a new hospital in the Ville, then the center of the black community here in St. Louis. Opened in 1937, Homer G. Phillips Hospital was the only public hospital to serve black people in St. Louis prior to desegregation. It went on to become one of the top general hospitals in the United States. Homer G. Phillips Hospital trained an entire generation of black doctors and nurses who would come from across the world to, to St. Louis to learn and then bring that knowledge back to their communities. By the time it ceased services in 1979, it had trained the largest number of black doctors and nurses in the world. While some are now unfairly trying to claim Homer G. Phillips Hospital legacy for themselves, we recognize that its impact ranges far beyond just one small facility. Homer G. Phillips Hospital put St. Louis on the map in a powerful way and is an, is an essential part of our city's history. Its legacy belongs to the community which it served.